think of the web like an iceberg. You've got the surface web up top. That's the internet you see and use every day. What's submerged is the deep web, an anonymous online space only accessible by specific software. And then there's the dark web. Now that's the part of the deep web that hides your identity and location. The dark web is a series of encrypted networks that helps anonymize people's usage of the internet. It's relatively easy for anyone to access this network. All they need is darknet software. The most common networks are Tor, I2B and Freenet. Tor is the most popular out of these. Tor allows a person to serve the internet anonymously. So their web traffic is basically encrypted and when they view the web, the encrypted traffic won't be attributed to them or their location. The content on the dark web ranges from the notorious to the noble. For some users like journalists and whistleblowers, the dark web is just about their identity and protection. But more often than not, it's tied to the world of cybercrime. A lot of criminals use this cloak of anonymity to mask their illegal activities.